Hello and welcome to Fresh Box Office. Today we're going to do the movie review for Sanju. You've been waiting for this movie and the wait is over. To begin with, I am foretelling there will be widespread national crying, not outside the theater but within the theaters and inside because I've never seen as many men on my left and right and across the rows mashing and mopping their faces with handkerchief. Now, Amir Khan can finally be spared from his Satya Mev Jayate crying memes. Have I ever wished a Rajkumari Rani film to end? I don't remember. But this movie is a leap of confidence and craft by a humble and amazing director. He knows we are a nation of criers. No wonder our biggest film star, Shah Rukh Khan, is the master of crying scenes and we love melodrama. Come on. Let me dispel some rumors immediately for you. Jim Saab is not playing Salman Khan and Vicky Kaushal is not playing Kumar Gaurav. But this is a real and honest movie review, so hop on. Sanjay is a movie about terrible choices of a good man, Sanjay Dutt. Sanjay Dutt is a simple and sentimental person. When destiny offloads a sentimental man a truckload of troubles, he doesn't really think or apply his mind. What he does is he drifts. You have to give Sanjay Dutt some credit for having the spine to tower above it all and be brave against malice, slander, rage, dispute and loss. He redeems himself finally. He plays the game fair even when dealt with a lousy hand of cards. The story of Sanju is two parts, personal struggle in the first and social in the second. Drugs are pre-interval, terrorism charges are post-interval. Although such a sharp bisection affects truthful and powerful storytelling but for a larger audience thronging into theatres, yeah, 53,000 screens are released worldwide, out of which 4,000 screens are in India alone. This works really better for them when you keep things separate. Sanju is a beautiful, delightful screenplay. It never rushes, never slows down. It's like a spring tale. On one hand, it is a telltale by one of the smartest filmmakers of this country. On the other hand, you'll have a lot of questions unanswered like ye kyu, wo kyu. But just as Shakespeare ne kaha hai, a lot of thinking spoils a Bollywood movie. So please don't overanalyze Mamu. Sanju at its heart is a tale of relationship and trust. A father and his son whose battles are entwined to the very end. They give us a memorable film and beautiful scenes. After this movie, Sanjay Dutt and Sunil Dutt will be part of modern folklore. But I think that the father son had helped each other to help overcome their pain. But it is also a story of friendship, love and other emotions. And you'll be very invested in the story of Sanjay Dutt and his friend Kamli from US. In Bollywood, Ranveer Kapoor is the finest acting package of our generation. Banda kya kaam karta hai? His belief, commitment and acting while playing another actor who is also acting in other movies is unprecedented in cinemas. The award brigades, commercial or not, will be begging for his appearance and presence this year. Paresh Rawal has given us a dauntless Sanjay Dutt who has nerves of steel and unshakable in times of trouble within the family and in the profession. Man, oh man, those were the times and those were the people and those were the women. It is ultimately about a father's son story and in that Vicky Kaushal is an artist from someone who has graduated from Anurag Kashyap's school of storytelling who debuted with Masan and now fitting and slipping in so beautifully into Hirani's space and universe, it is worthy of applause. He has got the mood and the pitch perfectly. Manisha Koirala as Sanjay Dutt is pleasant and she strikes the perfect note because she has herself gone through harrowing experience of cancer. Dea Mirza as Manita, Anushka as Rajkumari Rani in spirit and Jim Sarv as a drug peddler are great to watch. The ensemble makes a mark individually and also wholly. You'll come out of the theatres with a sniffle in your nose. You'll come out of the theatres with a sniffle and a running nose but long after Sanju is finished, it stays in your heart like the memory of a warm and amazing person whose errors and trials were humans but his reflections and reconciliations were much more humane. The music of the film tugs at your heart, particularly the Haran Medan Fateh song which is exhilarating. You want to climb the mountain just like Sanju, picturized on Manisha Koirala and Ranbir Kapoor, the song gave me goosebumps. 
Ravi Verma cinematography is a welcome addition. It's the first time both the director and cinematographer are working real and fantastic blend in very well in his lenses and color scheme. At a running time of 152 minutes, there is not a single moment you can look away from screen. It's a challenge. You cannot look away. Rajkumar Hirani has smattered the film with so much brilliance and has already got a national thank you with all the advanced booking. This time, reality, my friends, is better than expectations. A spectacular tale on sale, Lloyd. India's weekend is sorted. Go watch, enjoy, have fun. Thank you for watching my review. Come tell me what you felt. So I'm going with four stars out of five. Sanju is spectacular. Please like and share the video. Please comment and let us know what we could improve. Subscribe to the channel for more such reviews. See you very soon.